Plus Moody. I've got 200 mils of um, skimmed milk, one banana, and one quite big strawberry. Look how big it is. I thought I was getting really boring with fruity milkers, so I thought I'll make it for you. Mm. That's really nice. Oh, it's almost like a fry, of course. Oh. <laughs> Thomas and I are going on our daily um, shopping. I just need to uh, manage to put him in the car. Come on. Let's go in the car. Thomas loves shopping. Ooh. Today for lunch, I'm making chicken soup. Um, this is really easy. It only takes about half an hour. And I love it. I love chicken soup, especially in really cold days like today. So what I have here is one small chopped onion, half a bell pepper, one carrot and one potato. I've chopped everything in little cubes. So now our water is boiling, I'm going to put everything in. Add salt, black pepper. chicken stock. Thomas, are you waiting for lunch? Huh? So we brought our vegetables to boil. I've left them boil for five minutes. Now I'm going to add the chicken. I've got one chicken breast which I cut on a very small cubes. I'm going to add it in. Give it a good stir. I'm going to leave it for 20 minutes now. I don't know if you've ever um, heard of these. It's a type of pasta. It's really, really tiny. So I'm going to add about one handful in my soup. It gives it a bit of texture and it's really filling after that. So when, when I do chicken soup, I always put a handful of these. See, I like my soup really creamy. So what I do to make my soup really creamy is just before it's ready, I'm going to add about two spoons of yogurt. This is fat-free yogurt. And I'm going to add one yolk, just the yolk. I'm going to mix it. And I'll leave it here ready until our soup is almost ready. We are going to add it in. Our soup is minutes away from ready. So I'm going to take it off the fire. And I've told you about my yogurt mixtures I'm going to add in. The little trick here is we don't want uh, scrambled eggs in our soup. Take a bit of the hot soup and put in the yogurt. Now give it a mix. and slowly add it in. I 
I bought some uh, finely chopped parsley as well, which I'm going to add in. And our soup is ready. Thomas can't wait to eat this as well. Bon appetit!